On November 27, 2024, the Ukrainian Ministry of Defense officially approved the Onsila Sturm 4 by 4 Armored Personnel Carrier, APC, for operational use. This marks a significant milestone in Ukraine's ongoing efforts to bolster its military mobility and protection, as the shortage of APCs has long been a challenge for the Ukrainian armed forces. With ongoing conflict against Russia and a pressing need for armored vehicles, the Onsila Sturm is poised to address some of these deficiencies. The Onsila Sturm is a domestically produced variant of the Onsila APC, which itself was developed under a Polish license based on the Ukrainian Dozer B. The vehicle is equipped with a remotely controlled combat module, likely armed with a KPVT 14.5mm heavy machine gun and a 7.62mm machine gun mounted above it. These weapon systems will significantly enhance the combat capability of Ukrainian forces in the field. The Onsila Storm is designed to accommodate three crew members and six additional troops, offering a balance of protection and mobility. Its turbo diesel engine, paired with an automatic transmission, enables excellent speed and maneuverability, with a fuel range exceeding 700 kilometers. The vehicle's armor is built to withstand small arms fire, shrapnel and mines, though specific resistance capabilities against explosions have not been disclosed by the Ministry of Defense. In addition to its combat capabilities, the Onsila Storm boasts several features designed to improve its operational efficiency. These include automatic tire inflation, hydraulic power steering, air conditioning with heating capabilities, an automatic fire suppression system, and a filter ventilation unit. The vehicle also features a winch for self-recovery and towing, ensuring that it can operate in a variety of combat and field conditions. Its modular design allows for the creation of different configurations tailored to specific mission requirements. Ukraine's armed forces have faced a significant shortage of APCs, a problem that has been exacerbated by the destruction of existing vehicles in ongoing combat and the increasing demands of military operations. The need for armored personnel carriers is critical for ensuring the mobility and safety of Ukrainian troops on the front line. In response to this challenge, Ukraine has ramped up domestic production and sought international assistance. By December 2023, Ukrainian factories had increased their APC production five-fold compared to the previous year. Despite these efforts, the demand continues to outpace supply, leading Ukraine to acquire older models from international partners. Notably, Sweden has supplied PBV-302 APCs, originally produced in the 1960s, to help meet operational needs. Additionally, the United States has provided Bradley Infantry Fighting Vehicles, which have been deployed in combat. The Onsila Sturm, however, represents a crucial step toward increasing Ukraine's self-sufficiency in armored vehicles. Its domestic production ensures that the Ukrainian military has access to a reliable and locally made solution, easing reliance on international support. The Onsila Sturm is the latest in a line of armored vehicles developed from the Dozer B, which was first unveiled by the Kharkiv Morozov Machine Building Design Bureau in 2004. The Dozer B was officially presented in 2007 and production began in 2014 in response to the growing demand for armored vehicles during the Russian-Ukrainian conflict. Despite initial production delays, only 10 units of the Dozer B were delivered to the Ukrainian military by 2016, primarily due to engine supply issues. In 2013, Polish company Mista, in collaboration with Lassenaire Limited, acquired a license to produce the Dozer B, leading to the creation of the Onsila. The Onsila incorporated numerous modifications to meet NATO standards, including enhanced ballistic protection, redesigned hatches, improved mine resistance, and the replacement of the Deutz engine with an Iveco engine, which provided improved performance. The Onsila is equipped with a 12.7mm NSV machine gun and offers ballistic protection compliant with Stanag 4569 Level 2, with optional upgrades to Level 3. Variants of the Onsila include Command, Reconnaissance, Patrol, medical and riot control vehicles, while the Dozer B has versions designed for special operations, ambulance duties, and NBC, nuclear, biological and chemical reconnaissance. The Onsila has been successfully deployed in Ukraine, with at least 30 units delivered by March 2023, and the 100th unit expected by February 2024. The Onsila Storm represents a vital addition to Ukraine's fleet of armored personnel carriers. As the Ukrainian military continues to face significant challenges on the battlefield, the Onsila Sturm's advanced features, combined with its domestic production, provide a much-needed boost to Ukraine's defense capabilities. This new APC underscores the importance of enhancing domestic defense production while maintaining international cooperation in meeting the evolving needs of the Ukrainian armed forces.